How's it going everybody, Budget Pokemon here, and in this video I'm gonna be opening this Arceus V figure collection. Now the reason why I'm opening this product in particular is because for me personally, this is the best product of the year 2022. Because not only do you get an awesome looking promo card and an awesome looking figure, you also get right back here a Cosmic Eclipse pack, and of course Chilling Rain which is kinda meh, and also two brilliant stars packs. So the value in, in this box right here is actually quite insane, because if you calculate it, when I rip this open, or at least try to, the value of this box is actually really, really good. You have the Cosmic Eclipse pack, which is worth, I think, about 10 euros currently, and then both the brilliant stars, which are 4 euros each, and then Chilling Rain, which is kind of just 3 euros. So, first of all, this figure which is actually really, really nice looking. Down there is your branded stamp. Actually, can I put this somewhere in the video so it's visible? Suppose we can put it here. There we go. Okay, let me get out the promo card. So here we have the promo and I really love this promo. Like This is a beautiful looking artwork. And this actually used to be a promo for uh, pre-ordering Pokemon Legends Arceus over in Japan. You got that when you pre-ordered that the Japanese game. And you get it here in this box, which is really, really nice. I'm gonna get a sleeve for this one. So there we go. Very nice promo. Um, this is valued for about 3 euros, so in total you have like 21 euros alone in packs. And this one is 3 euros. This one is trying to be sold for 6, but I don't think anyone's gonna buy this for 6, but this is a nice looking figure. So yeah, the value of this box is actually insane. Which is why I really, really like this box. Oh, I suppose, there you go. There is the code card for this box. Enjoy and good luck to whoever gets that, I suppose. So we gotta keep, we gotta keep the Co Cosmic Eclipse pack for last, right? We gotta keep that for last. So let's open the, the Brilliant Stars pack, or one of them first, I suppose. Um, I, don't, I don't even remember what I pulled from this. I think I pulled the, the Secret Wear Articuno. There's the code card for that, and since we don't have that many, let's just do the card trick. We got a Metal Energy, Roseanne's Backup, Floatzel, a Choice Band, Duskull, Farfetch'd, Execute, Grimer, Sneasel, a Reverse Piplup, oh nice, and a V, Shaman V, fitting for the pack art, which was actually a Shaman V star. Very, very nice, we got one pull at least, which is quite nice. I think, yeah, I only pulled the Secret Wear Articuno, and I can't actually remember what I, what else I pulled. I didn't pull an alt art. Hopefully, hopefully I didn't use all my luck for the Astral Radiance opening. If you haven't seen that video, go check that out. We pulled an alt art in that video, which was really, really nice. Really, really nice alt art. One one of the ones I'm chase I was chasing too, so that was really, really cool. Spiral Energy, Furfro, Diglett, Larvista, Inkay, Rockruff, a single strike Urshifu. Oh nice! And another pull. A Blaziken V. Now, while these pulls are great, I'm not really... I don't think we're gonna pull something out of the... Out of the... Oh, hang on, the figure is out of the picture. We're not gonna pull anything out of here. We pulled two things already, but you never know. You never know. And Cosmic Eclipse is an awesome, awesome pack. It was the set in Sun and Moon that introduced character rares. And most of these are absolutely incredible. So it's definitely worth checking out. If a booster box wouldn't be that expensive, I'd definitely open a booster box of that. But it's it's quite pricey. Quite, quite pricey. But yeah. What are the other sets coming up? Uh, we have Incandescent Arcana coming on uh, September 2nd, at least in Japan. It'll take about a week for it to, to get to, to Germany. Oh, nice! We got a Mimikyu VMAX. Yo, dude! We've got three, three pulls in a row! Three pulls in a row, look at that, dude! What an amazing opening! So I was saying, we've got Incandescent Arcana, 2nd of September, releasing in Japan. Um, will take quite some time to, 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 or some time, to get it to Germany. About a week, which might actually overlap. Ooh, I think I should have choked the code card backwards. Hopefully I didn't spoil anything. But let's just do four cards. Let's take this a bit slow right here. 
because I don't get to open Cosmic Eclipse every day and I really love this set. I would really love to open a booster box of this. Gloom. A Torkoal. Cricketot. Paliotoad. Whalmer with the psychedelic artwork. An Onyx. A Togedemaru. A Reverse Skrelp. And... Ah, a non-holographic Cradilly. Okay, we didn't get anything out of that Cosmic Eclipse pack, but that is fine. Because we pulled three things out of those loose packs, which is absolutely cool. And we got this nice promo. And we've got the figure. I think that, that was a nice box. And you get to open a legacy pack. What else can you ask for? So that was absolutely amazing. Um, as I've said, the next set I'm probably going to open is Incandescent Arcana and Lost Origin. Those might uh, overcut in some way, because as I've said, Incandescent Arcana takes about a week to get to Germany, and then Lost Origin, which releases 9th of September, um, probably about three days until I get that. And I still have another short planned. Um, there's one short coming out uh, later this week, I think. So. Stay tuned for that, and if you enjoyed this video, then thank you so much for watching. Uh, leave a like, leave a sub, if you really liked it, and hope I will see you in the next one. Peace, peace.